Oh, hi. How's it going? Um, today is Monday, August 16th, and I'm doing a vlog this week. Isn't that exciting? Because I've got some things going on this week, so I figured I would document it for funsies. I am selling my books at a little market thing this weekend, which I'm excited about, so I have to prepare for that. And I also have to prepare for a sports medicine clinic appointment on Wednesday for my hip thing that if you haven't seen my other vlogs, if you haven't been around for it, I've been having problems with an area near my hip for a very long time since like September. So almost if, oh my God, almost a year. It took me a while to actually like see my doctor about it though. Cause I was just like waiting for the pain to go away. And then finally when it wasn't going away, I made an appointment with my doctor and I saw bunch of different doctors I saw. I got x-rays. I got an ultrasound. I got an MRI. They all came back normal. A uh, bunch of people thought it was a hernia for a while and I was hoping it was a hernia because those are very fixable, but it wasn't. And so anyway, now this sports medicine doctor thinks that it's a trapped nerve. And in order for her to know for sure, we have to irritate it as much as possible. And then she's going to freeze the nerve, and if it makes all the pain go away, when she freezes the nerve, then we know it's the nerve that's the problem. And if it doesn't, then it's something else. But anyway, so I have to make it super painful. Which I'm not looking forward to, but I am looking forward to the end result. Getting closer to having this fixed, because I'm getting sick of not being able to do my regular workouts. And I'm also getting sick of just being in constant pain. <laughs> like, I sleep with an ice pack in my pajama pants every night. So... Anyway, we're going to be documenting all the fun things this week. I just finished reading Malibu Rising last night, which I'm not going to talk about. I'm going to you have to wait for my August wrap up for that. And I just started reading Spinning Silver. If any of you follow me on TikTok and saw my short video of us trying to beat the storm home and not making it and all my books getting ruined, it's one of those. It's looks it doesn't look terrible in in video form but it's awful it's in terrible shape all my books that i spent all of my chapters points on that i i took years to save up for these points and i finally had enough to spend them and uh they all got ruined they they all fell <laughs> they all fell into the rainy road twice so <laughs> that was great it makes a nice crinkly sound though that's nice <laughs> Anyway, I'm only on chapter two, but I really like it so far. I don't think I need more bookmarks. Like, I have significantly less Saving Mason bookmarks than other bookmarks, but I still feel like if I make more, I'm not going to sell them. I did get new pens, though, for signing books, um, which I know people use markers to sign books, and using a Sharpie, like, it makes a nicer signature, I feel like, but it bleeds through the page. So I have different color pens to match the different colors of the books I have. I'm now working on my book that I started writing during third lockdown that I'm actually already doing like kind of a big like editing overhaul on it and I'm only a third of the way through the first draft. But my almonds are stale. I think I left the bag open. I suck. I'm trying to make this unrealistic story as realistic as possible and like if this was happening to someone in real life what would their actual reaction be and it's difficult but i think i'm getting there i can't get over how much this pain in my hip area is like such a normal part of my life at this point and also how much it hurts i literally just bent down to plug my phone in and it pinched so much <laughs> Oh. Hello. I'm about to do my little upper body workout, which is the only workout I can do that doesn't cause me pain. And I call it little because it's 12 minutes long and it's pretty chill. Um, I don't work until 11 today, so I'm hoping that I will have time to read. It's always my plan to read before going to work when I work at 11, and I almost never do. It's 8.30, and... I'm going for my run, which is going to go terribly for three reasons. One, well, it's going to hurt. Like, I'm already in pain, so. <laughs> I'm terribly out of shape, so 
it's <laughs> and three it's well I mean it's not hot out it's it's like a it's warm but it's gonna get hot when I'm running I like running when it's chilly out I don't like running when it's warm <laughs> oh my god I'm so out of shape I don't even think I've gone a kilometer yet <laughs> whenever I get back into running for real I'm definitely gonna have to do the couch to 5k to get myself back into it oh my god that was hard this is the worst assignment I've ever been given. It hurts. It hurts more than it normally does in a regular day, but I feel like it should hurt more. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I'm not gonna do another workout. It is sore. The more I'm lying here, the more sore it's getting. And I also have to fill up. Maybe I should turn this down or off. She's just doing workouts by herself. Poor Maddie. <laughs> I also have to go fill up my water jug. I had to do it. I was, would have done it yesterday, but I was like, I should save it for today because I usually am a little sore after carrying that in the house as well. Do I deserve a cold brew in 10 minutes? Yeah. I think I do. Hi. Thank you. Thanks. You want to share a Timbit? Come up here then. Well, don't lick it, just bite it, because I want some of it too. There you go. Okay, I'm going to my appointment. I think I'm going to eat a banana in the car. I'm kind of hungry. So I just had my nerve frozen, and it still hurts, but I feel like it hurts differently than it did before, and I'm... <sighs> um, since, I don't know, half an hour after getting this nerve block I have been in more pain than I have been th this whole entire year that I've had this pain <laughs> um it's five o'clock so I got this done what two and a half hours ago <clears throat> I did a google so and it said that it's it's uncommon but that a nerve block can actually irritate the nerve instead of freeze it and make it cause more pain so I'm hoping that that's what's happened and that it is the nerve that's the problem because if it's the nerve that's the problem, it's fixable. Oh, hi. I called in sick because I'm still in pain and it hurts to clear my throat. What is this bullshit? This is ridiculous. You're ridiculous. Do I even have bomb arrows turned on? Yeah. Mm. No, of course I'm not okay, you bitch. Hooray! I beat him! <sighs> One would think that with two days off, Two extra days off. Not just two days off, two extra days off. I still have a weekend after tomorrow that I would get a lot of reading done. I read about two pages, but like I was all in pain and stuff. I didn't want to. <laughs> Oh, hey, how's it going? Me? Mm. Um, I went to work for an hour today. Uh, I was like, no, I can't do this. It's too painful. I can't do this for seven hours. Uh, so I came home and laid on the couch with, uh, with ice um, until yeah, about an hour ago. And then I did a little tidy of my apartment. And I'm in pain again, so that's great. So I just put some ice on me again uh, for about 20 minutes. Oh, look, I still have dishes that I have to do. Um, and my friend's coming to get me. We have to go to Walmart and get stuff for, like, lunches tomorrow with our event. Um, and then I'll just come back and ice myself again. Another friend is coming over, though, um, when I come back, which is fun. 
Um, hooray for vaccines. <laughs> oh, hi. I'm not naked. I have a towel on. My friend came over tonight. Look at, look at what she brought me from her garden. Look at this zucchini. What? What? Oh my God, it's huge. So we decided to go to Tim's for breakfast before going to our event. And they're out of eggs and hash browns. It's 8.15 in the morning. <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> How long do you think it will take? 10, do you think it'll take more than 10 minutes? I mean, we're already gonna be late. The other Tim's we decided to go to has a very, very, very long drive through lineup. It like goes all the way around the building. And we're already late, but I also didn't eat breakfast. <laughs> Yeah, neither like, did I. We finally just got our food. We weren't in the line for that long. But right after we left, Laura was like, mm, I wonder if it would have been faster if we went inside. And I was like, oh yeah. I forgot that was an option. <laughs> I'm just used to not going right. into places now. Yep. I'm just standing here watching while Laura does all the work. Because I'm in pain, it's a laugh. <laughs> I got a perfect little mask pouch. When there's no one around, I can just put my mask in the air. Nice. When people come close, I can just whip it on. My cold brew is now a lukewarm brew. Delicious. <laughs> it's hot already. Uh, we put shades up though, and it's made a big difference. I think that was. So we've got walls there. Look at how nice and cute these are. They're my favorite. Yeah. If someone bought agree. me one of these three, I'd be happy. Although I'd prefer this one or this one. Yeah. These two. I like this one because it's red. But <laughs> but this one is so cute also. And this one too. I just like the shapes of these ones better. I like the swirly on this one. Yeah, yeah me too. I have to get an ice cream. We have come inside the tent because... It's not providing us shade anymore. Because hot. It's very hot. It's hot. Hot. It's so gross. It's so gross. I'm so sticky. Why am I wearing this? I don't know. <laughs> these are my favorite of Laura's earrings. And I bought a pair of these for my friend once. They reminded me of her. And also, I love them. I would never wear them, but I love them. I would never wear these earrings, Laura. <laughs> That's, that's rude. No, but they're so, I love them so much. Oh sure, put the card right in front of my face. It's all good. I didn't want to be in your video anyway. Good. I didn't want you in it. That's why I covered your face. Rude. True. I might wear earrings like this if I had to wear fancy earrings at a fancy event. But I would feel it's super fancy wearing dangly earrings. I, I, I have a pair of dangly earrings that I got from my friend Lisa. And I've worn them twice, I think, to a fancy event, and I felt like ridiculously fancy. I was like, these are too nice. Even, they're not, they're like casual earrings. But because they dangle, I'm like, I don't wear dangly earrings. <laughs> I have only sold Calypso. Everyone's buying Calypso today, but that's... But four copies! <laughs> and five bookmarks, all to the same guy. It was pretty cool. He was like, oh. He just kept putting them down on the table. He's like, anyone who reads this is gonna get a bookmark. I was like, oh. <laughs> I swear, this is the hottest day we've had all summer. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. <laughs> We're all packed up. Well, basically, we have to put everything in the car, but everything is torn down. Hey, you. Um, I just wanted to let you know we're all packed up and everything, but we're just gonna go for a quick swim in our clothes because we are disgusting hot. So, uh, yeah, we're just gonna go for a quick swim and then we'll be heading back into town, okay? I just didn't want you to worry. Oh, so much better. Anyway, I need to have a shower. Oh, I'm so comfortable in my wet clothes right now, though, because I was so hot. But I got a sandwich from Tim's because I'm going to my friend's now. Not Laura's, but uh, I have to have a shower first but and eat my sandwich. Uh, just because I've been chronicling my, um, my hip thing, I guess I'll update you on that. I didn't do much um, lifting today. Laura did a lot of that, which was nice. And it was sore throughout a lot of the day, but because I was just sitting and not doing anything, it wasn't too bad. 
but it was like pounding. Um, and then at the end of the day, when we were packing up, anytime I bent over, it was very pinchy, which is normal. It normally pinches when I bend over. Uh, it just felt more painful than normal because it's already in extra pain. So it was just ugh, more of it. And then, um, and then it felt mostly fine when we went into the water and everything. But since being home, it's pretty sore again. <laughs> so I thought I'd just update on that. But it definitely is getting better. It's definitely cl getting closer to what it just feels like normally before I got the injection. So hopefully by Monday when I have that. Because I'm not going to, I don't want to call, I don't want to skip work again. I'll feel terrible and I'm sure I'm sure by Monday it'll be it'll be okay enough for me to have an eight hour shift I'm sure I hope if it's not good enough by then I'm gonna cry <laughs> good job Nat yay <laughs> I am going to my mom's because my uncle is visiting, so I'm going to go have supper with them and then we're going to go to the beach. We have, um, we have I've already scarfed like half of it.